Do they still have benches? Earth is praying at the altar in hopes of putting a stop to Sephiroth. There will be no chance to rest beyond this place where your party is prepared. See, I could have done it here. My party? Oh my god, they're, they're freaking told me she's praying. Look at this ancient bench. I'm just calling it a bunch. Party of one, how lonely. I'm sure it's fine. I don't... I, I could... If I wasn't streaming, I'd be like in materia purgatory, like setting things perfectly. But I'm just gonna wing it. I'm sure it's fine. And if it's not, then we'll make it fine later, but... You know what I mean? Like, I could be in menus all day. But we're here to see Aerith win. You're the same way here? Right, I just can't be asked to change material right now. You just eated it too. <laughs> but Aerith needs us. And she's trying to keep us at bay, possibly. But who the fuck knows? I feel like the whispers are. Oh god. Sorry, I didn't check the sales at the vendor. <laughs> Don't stop, I'm wondering you to cry. Okay, these freaking ghosts. Great. Down in front. Great. Great, great picture. I'm never gonna. You're making you try so hard only for it to not matter. Just don't press it. They ma they're making Cloud do it. But what if I just don't? Put it down. I'm not. It's not me. No, they're gonna do it by default. I told you, everything's fine. God, I love how accurate and faithful that shot was, though. Oh, you press it to resist, not hit her? Well, I guess it didn't matter in the end. Look, we saved her. Everything's fine. Cool. We're good. <gasps> Vincent's here! Everything's fine. Especially because Vincent's here. She's not here. <gasps> what happened? That was so cruel! Oh no! If the music hits as soon as that touches the ground.
it. Well, that sucks. Oh my god. I can't go through this again. <laughs> what did Cloud think he saved? <laughs> This is new. It's okay. There's no Sephiroth in this background. See, this makes it a little bit more definite that this is part of the plan. People seem still seem to think that However, it wasn't her plan. You'll never see the truth with such clouded eyes. Shut up! <laughs> After all, you're just a puppet. Is it actually? Just, oh my god. Hey, Novi. Life Clinger. Why don't, like, Genova Aerith music plays? Are you kidding me? Oh my god, everyone's got their. Everyone's pissed, so they have their limit breaks up. And the, the fact that the music still stays is amazing. I don't even know what I'm doing right now. I'm just hitting buttons and hoping I'm right. We want you to cry while fighting. Yeah, everyone except Cloud, yeah. Everyone's fired up, but... Cloud, Cloud's like, he seems like he's in control mostly because he knew he had that moment with Aerith there where he's like, don't worry, I got this. But everyone's like pissed because they don't know. They don't know that Aerith's, um, like, unfortunately her plan. I mean, I'd still be pissed. Where's Vincent? Can you even comfort me? Take the lead. Don't let me down. Yeah, I'm gonna use my. Alright, Yuffie, Yuffie, and Cloud just to get the synergy up, and then I'm gonna make them use it. And Yuffie use it. Yeah, 
Jenova, not now. I'm grieving. Even know what you're doing. <laughs> like, I actually. Oh, you got a barrier, do you? That's nice. That's not even. It said immune, but the fire still melted it. Cloud right now. This is my brain. Alright, you see your shields? <laughs> your barriers down? Where's, uh, where's my other? <laughs> she left the party! Okay, hold on. Alright, I'm- I'm good, I'm good. I just- I- you can't- you can't just, like, have that and then- No, I don't want to watch again! You can't just do that and then throw a freaking boss fight at me with a barrier. Jesus Christ. All right. Oh, I'm in it. I'm ready. I'm ready now. The music didn't help me. That's literally it. Like the music, I'm like, I'm not even looking at the fight. I'm looking at my health bar. It's just like sad. All right, I'm ready. I'm ready, I'm ready. I need my ATB up though. All right, doppelganger. Everyone's ATB is gonna go up, and then I'll be ready for whatever barrier is. Come on, get your ATB up. I don't even know what's going on. going on oh he had, hold yuffie i couldn't tell i couldn't see her i was legit like is something wrong let me grab people last time but i didn't see her Stay unable. Use a poison. Use Comet? Oh, that fire melted your stupid ass barrier. Yuffie, are you using Comet?
Ah, oh, you stupid. Blocking of the health bar. I hate when that happens. What, fight Genova by yourself? You think we're gonna just beat her this this one? Like well I mean I guess we have to. I like the eyeball background. Friends back in my party, please. I really need Yuffie's comment, even though she's not doing it. Hey, my friends! Yeah. They're back! That was easy. Stay strong. Yo, what if everyone was just like usable? <laughs> All right, no time to be sad. It's on you. I'm your big shot. You can use comet. Always, always a Resident Evil boss. Yes, get pressured. Felt that, did you? How about some more? See, Jill says that. And so does Yuffie. Basically Resident Evil. Get staggered, you stupid alien. Wait, do I... Cloud can use his level two. Ascension? When Yuffie's done being a beast with Comet. Wait, Cloud, did you not use Ascension? I fucking told you! <laughs> Alright, let's uh... This heat, Genova. <laughs> Tifa, Tifa and Cat. Oh, oh, oh. What a duo, Tifa and her cat.
Does that not do anything? I don't understand if magic is doing anything. Oh, it is, okay. Zero material and cat here. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> they do warn you on the bench, but it's like so much is happening, you wouldn't think to freaking really worry about it. You're like, I'm sure it's fine. I think I think someone's gonna die. Oh, he needs to use his I'm gonna somersault this right wing. I don't fucking know. Can she even hit it? She hit it! Damn! Alright. Like, it sucks like spending, like, Moogle... Here. Okay, now I, I have no choice but to Moogle magic box. No, I've been silenced! It works! Good kitty! Yes! I can handle Red and Barret. I love so much that Barret calls, calls him Nanaki. They really had such a moment in his trial. I can't wait. Can't wait for them all to have that conversation and call him Nanaki. This is so cool. This is, I love I love this because even Sun has like parts where you have to swap between party for this. I just need his ATB up. No, oh, I've been stopped. Watch this. Ready? 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 Bam! Stardust Ray. Oh, Barret's gonna die. I don't know, can you both get him? I think they do just want you to just limit them. I don't know, it's kind of fun to like play it too. I don't know. Great cloud. Can you crawl slash? Don't worry. Yuffie's gonna comet it. I don't think she's commenting. I don't Woo! That was close. I was like, do not be close to the ray. Yo, power of teamwork, let's go. Oh my god, I hope Vincent and Sid also are part of this. Yes! Fight the shit out of him. I love this.
<laughs> Literally. This is like reverse admin children. Instead of lifting him up, they just throw him down. Ah! Oh! No way. <laughs> no, no, no. Where's that in regular combat? Oh, my squad. Let's freaking go. Cloud D, are you... You need to Kiraga. Why is it pet and Barrett? The fuck is this? Oh my god. <laughs> seven, seven, seven. Fuck, I can't do region anymore. Let's switch it up. from <laughs> I don't know if I was looking for this one that's Oliver solo that's Oliver stay up solo right there that thanks for the resub 70 months seven minutes ago this is... this is nuts. Yo, mayhem go around, throw the cat! Oh yeah, I've seen this from far away, they just have a dumb laser. <laughs> it's so much funnier to watch from far away, because they're just spinning around. <laughs> it's so stupid. Oh, bitch! I was so close on. Right. Pushing it. Oh, 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 is no help. Woo! That's freaking King Catchy is just jumping in front of it, taunting it. Like you, bitch. Genova. What now? What a pushover. Fully restored was Sephiroth next. Wouldn't be fully restored for nothing. Come on, Sephiroth. Oh, <gasps> Zach, can he join? The fourth party member. Zach? White, as far as the eye can see. Hey, anybody there? How about that? He's got a sword. Yeah. Huh. Oh, it's so cool to see them. Nice to see you too. Oh, okay. So, I hear you've been pretty busy. <gasps> oh, no way! I was kidding! No, this is amazing. Can we actually fight? Cloud, wake up. I'm here. Oh my god. Zach? Do, 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 can they- do they know? Zach. <gasps> this is so weird, I don't care. Uh, how's about we save the catching up for later? Well, like... Zach's kind of like, yeah, whatever. Oh my god, no, this is so weird. Look at the 
cover up, boys on the cover. That brother, you're gonna eat so much shit. You're gonna eat so much Buster Sword right now. Look, we're doing this again. Hell yeah. Part three is gonna have the same scene too. Two servings of Buster Sword coming right up. Ah! Yeah. Yeah. Follow my lead. Look at you taking charge. I like it. Tutorial on the final one of the final bosses. I don't know which it is. He's got launchers. You know what's an emote only? I think some of y'all have been bad if the chat's an emote only mode. Okay, I I can't I can't. I didn't retain any of that. Right. Long as you get what you want, who oh, so you can manually change the team. Anyway. <laughs> yes, meteor shots. Oh my god, he's got it all. This is this is so ridiculous, but I, I don't care. I've been wanting to see Cloud and Zack together again. Just being buds. Skewer, nice smith, idiot. Have some Buster Sword. Woo! alone. Nice miss, idiot. Oh, I should assess him, but... We have synergy abilities. Soldier's honor! I'm gonna die. Don't look away. Oh! The shoulder touch. Oh. And we got Octo slashed, but you know that was that wasn't fair. I freaking I freaking used my my synergy too, you cheater. Gonna make me do everything. God, hopefully it has enough time for reach Hiraga. Don't leave him alone! Get him! Oh my god, he's doing it! Dude, they have the best synergy. Bye now. God, every time I try to go in a Punisher, I'm like already in it because of the fucking input. Come on. This is gonna... I got you, guys. Freaking... No! I, you put him down right now. Going in. I got you, Zach. Did you see? Did you see? I saved him. Sephiroth, get up, you big baby. Can't handle the Buster Sword. My boys. Just as worlds unite, so do No, let them stay. No, let them stay. I want to act and club. Save her. Is this Dirt of Cerberus music? Shall we? It's the choir. This is so from Dirt of Cerberus. Oh, it is. It's freaking safe for Sephiroth already. Are we doing this alone? 
I really use that breath of reborn. His body. Oh my god. How big you get. I'm not backing down. I'm finishing this. You're as good as dead. I feel like this this choir is in a lot of stuff, by the way, but it's also in dirge. Like it's in Silent Hill 4 as well. But why are we fighting? It's gone now. Why are we fighting like not safer Sephiroth or Bizarro Sephiroth, whatever? It's Sephiroth Reborn. What is going on? Because he's like, is this him trying to merge the worlds? I don't know where even I am. Hello? Oh. <laughs> Big dumb face. He looks so weird. Why well, I have to do this by myself? No way. This is so from Dirge. It's this it's sampling the same choir, it's just way, way slower. It's throwing me off. Vincent, where are you? Oops. Hell's Gate, resurrected being who now wields unimaginable might and commands the arbiters of fate. He seeks to pierce through the layers of existence and reunite fragmented space-time. He shall rule over the planet, create eternity. Okay. You say so. I mean, you're probably right. You're very- you're much larger than I am. What am I supposed to even do here? Other than just flail. We're meant to die. Because doing this alone is absurd. You're free. Free from the emote. Were you guys being bad and somebody had to put in emote only? Thank you, by the way. I also wasn't really looking at chat, though. Anyway, did you hear the dirge of servers music? There were haters. Why are you here if you hate the game? Fucking stop watching things you hate. What's the matter with you? Oh, purest opinions. Yeah, that's gonna happen. Then stop watching. <laughs> Literally, if you don't like something, solution, stop watching. Easy as that. If you're hate watching, then you have uh, other problems. Anyway, this game is cool. I don't know what's going on with Sephiroth Reborn though, <laughs> and why I can't. Why I'm dying here? I mean, I don't have anything. I feel like I have to die here because I'm not doing like I'm doing like peanut. Like yeah, I can like stagger him, but I'm doing this alone. This, this seems like if I die, it might expedite receiving some help from my my beloved friends I mean he doesn't really do much either but I'm running out of MP I 
I feel like I can't get close to him. I feel like I have to do this or like magic, but like I, my ATB is up the heel. And I don't know if I want to waste magic when I could. Here, how about. Hold on. I'm gonna use Sonic Boom. Sonic Boom. Finally! Get staggered, you fool. You're mine. Get ready. Um, I'm probably not gonna have enough. Finally, Jesus. But can I get my friends here? It's awfully lonely fighting Sephiroth Reborn. Not Rebirth, by the way. Oh, we just made the ghosties leak out. Tifa, Tifa Red and Cat. Maybe the whispers got her. You think they took him somewhere? Look out! Ooh, God, this game has got so many pretty shots. Okay, now we fight this one. So, are we? Is this like three separate Sephiroth Reborns? And that we all have to kill him at the same time or some crap. Aw, oh, what? No, he's got bombing. Aw. Oh. <laughs> They're all so bad already. This one's for Aerith. Yes! For this Aerith! Is this is we don't have time I thought it was this. Barrett. Come on! Because he's like, this is for Aerith, and he's not even in the party. I was like, I was holding square ready to shoot, but I'm not even Barrett. Okay, it's Tifa and her cats, or her, her pets. I think so. No! I thought it was a pixel away! Pixel away from getting staggered. I was mashing as much as I could. I don't have full heal. Red has an ability that depletes his, um, whatever gauge, vengeance. Oh, fuck. Returning to the live stream. Oh, that's so sad. God, if only, if only, uh, um, I could stagger him. That would have been fine. <laughs> that returning to the live stream live light is sad. All right, thank goodness. Any sign? Barrett, why do you get to say that and then you think they took him somewhere? Look out! Yeah, good thing for checkpoints. 
I don't mind if they throw random parties for you. I just wish, like, if since Barrett said the line and he's not even at the party, it just threw off, threw me off. All right, don't worry, don't worry. I need to get Ket in Moogle mode ASAP. Yeah, there's like nine different options. Look at them! I love this so much. They're freaking ready. This one's for Aerith. But I'm gonna go hang out over here. I don't have time for this. Come on. Oh, Red doesn't have time for this. Here we go. Oh, come on! That happened so much faster, I swear. Probably because I was trying to get Cat's stupid thing up. I mean, I'm probably gonna die again. He already did cast it and I died. Okay, we're good, we're good. Jesus! Leave me alone! Okay, if I can do true strike trick really quickly. Atonement? Wait, you feet. You done? But his health. Okay. GG's. Bring it back like that. The wings are healing it. That's not good. Both wings? Oh, he's got both. I don't even have time to heal, I feel. No! Oh my god! Another one? I need to get a summon. I thought I might be okay. Oh, they didn't do it. No, like this, they're asleep or something. How dare you do that to my cat? They're doing it, yes! <laughs> All right. 
Are both its wings the same? We do backline command. Um, mayhem go round might be good. And star shower. Look, Bahamut! <laughs> he was getting lasered! <laughs> he barely had a chance. That mayhem go wrong or round or whatever is great. Anyway, solo Zack time. <laughs> that that synergy is so good. <laughs> yeah, that worked out so great. Best synergy. What's going on with Zack now? I don't know, Zack. This motherfucker is here too. Yeah, it really is just separate. your trains. And whatever happens, protect your honor as a soldier. Hell yeah, boys. Yeah, it really is. <gasps> what is this? Oh, is that arcane ward or something? Looks like it's supposed to protect me. I don't know if I stand in it long enough. Hold on, hold on, hold on! Okay, whatever. Does Zach have long range? God, is this like... Yes! Okay, so that's- that's... Cloud portal thing. Okay, I need a heal. So charge stays as long as you don't get hit, I guess. Nice camera angle. What is this? Sephiroth? Oh, he took my- God damn you. He took my regen from me, too. Together as one. Store. Let me fucking heal, bro. Got me good. Now I gotta get my ATB back up. All right, please have enough time. Finally. Oh shit, the chest. So was it five or four? I was in denial. Yeah, so- so this- this guy, Sephiroth, this guy, he freaking... He's- he found himself in every timeline. Damn it, I meant to do a chest. Whatever. My staggered face. 
Oh, it works. It's an AoE. <laughs> Yeah, I, I would love to try to do is like charge one and two stuff. But I feel like everything's happening too fast for me to try to learn it like on the fly right now. That's another five. Punch the hell out of this dude. Like how how insane is Sephiroth for actually being able to do this though? Alright, why do you have low health? Or oh, that's red. He's reborn. Sephiroth rebuilding himself. Yes, don't give up. Oh, yes. Mm hmm. This calls for more Is it, The wings are immune. Really slow one winged angel thing. I think it's like one. They're both not weak to physical. The song's kind of weird. I don't know how I feel about this version. Reduce damage, goddamn. You totally I see my ACD up, you know. back leading.
Okay, I have banishment, so if it brings its wing down, I can probably kill it. Go, go, no! Too late! Oh, it worked. Four time? Barrett, you might wanna... <laughs> oh, it moves, okay. Well, we can break it now. Oh, she doesn't have cure. Who, who does? I don't know how I feel about the steam. Mm, kinda sweating it. I just need Yuffie to use Comet. We're so close! Sucko! Haha! <laughs> Insta staggered. Wait! Is Yuffie gonna Comet? Can I? Yeah, Red's totally gonna die. Oh, everyone! No, everyone's gonna die. I don't know what that was. Oh, <laughs> I was so fast. Everyone's like struggling, like super last, like 10 HP, just because like nobody has freaking healing. That's okay. This part's not that hard. If I had to do the last one again, oh. We get to see this cool transition again. He farmed everyone for the kill. Yeah, I mean, I didn't know what that move was. I know it was gonna be a a one HP -er kind of thing. God, the, only, the part that sucks about this is like trying to build up ATB. Uh, but like 50 giga potions. Yeah, I've been not. Like, of course it's a cloud. Does he have... Bloodfang all physical? I keep thinking Bloodfang's like, um, I don't know why, because Fang is physical, but I keep thinking Bloodfang's like Stardust, right? That's his other one. Oi! Oh my god, where's that where the lines are? Alright. Alright, we're good. Ready? You won't Are you gonna fucking stop this?
This slow singing is weird. Okay, I'm just gonna... I'm gonna keep back as Yuffie, just for the ATV. Cause I, I guess the poison's only like, super up close. I wish I had heal on her. I think this is this girl I have no heals on. FIFA! Still here. We've got to take out the barrier. Yeah, yeah. What does Barret have? That's a bad idea. We've gotta take out the barrier. Yes, I know, it's the wings. I have I have weak magic! Yuki's got comet, but like I can't make her do it. Now everyone's poisoned. Finally! Is it even hitting? It is, really badly though. Fucking stop it? Did that not kill it? It was banishment, isn't it? Alright, whatever. Just freaking use Comet, Yuffie. She's like right up in the front. Yuffie! Comet and Yuffie. If only that went off before Comet. Alright, Red 13 has the most HP. I need to heal Yuffie, shit. The second that's crippled, I'm gonna use all my attack bullshit. Wait, she's not dead yet. I'm over here like... Nah, she's she's super dead. Alright. I love how this much- how this increases their EPTB so much. Like, if they can actually block... Okay, stop. Yeah, that's fine, because I have Chakra... for a big part of it. And then I'm just gonna use regular Thunder. And now her Kame strengthens. Go Kame, go! Oh, she doesn't have doppelganger anymore. I was like, why is she not attacking twice? Alright, Yuffie, Yuffie can kill it with her regular attack. Alright, sick. Now everyone's got synergy. been crippled just like that easy hey there, nothing's gonna stop us let's show him what we're made of 
easy. What can I do? Let's see. She doesn't have Dop out. He's angry. Alright, come on. Get out. Get out of there. No! <laughs> oh, that always takes them to- Okay, I thought I was just at low health. Okay, Avalanche- Oh, Mayhem go round. And then Yuffie. Okay, watch, watch, ready? Okay, maybe maybe not easy, maybe not easy. Okay, maybe maybe not easy. <laughs> what the fuck? He's insane. I can't do anything with this party. Oh my poor Barrett. Got some fight left in you. Far enough away or close enough. You know? There it I Okay, everyone's got their limit. Just fucking go. First Barret. No. Uh -uh. No. Yes, get staggered. Oh my god, look everyone's at fucking one HP. He's at like a pixel, but I'm not gonna stop hitting square. Jesus! <laughs> that fight is so sketchy. I, I'm sure there's like an easy way to do it. And I'll worry about that on hard mode, but holy shit. <laughs> there you are. That was just me and you. You got any more gimmick? What, these guys? Aww. I'm sure it's like Ghost Aerith or whatever. Aww. Let's end this together. Together. I must admit. I'm sorry for assuming that Dream World was you faking it. And that you don't know how women act. I saw what you did back there, Cloud. Maybe later. This ain't over. Right. Okay, let's finish this. That's it. Why don't it's my turn. <laughs> Oh, he's using his whispers. I love this. Fights like this are way more interesting than giant walls. This is so much cooler, and it's like in water. Like, I like the background. You teleported to my own ward. Don't even bother. 
Oh, he's in you now. He laughs. Keep it together. The frost, what are you doing? You will. I got this. No! Because he's weird. Oh, is it just magic? I think he's taking Aerith away. I don't really know what's going on. Man, I was so close. I need to get my ACB up a little faster. Aerith, are you good? I forgot. Um, can we deprotect him? I don't know. I just need synergy. Oh, that wing got fucked up. All right. You ready? Look, I really don't want to waste it here. It should be fine. Oh, that's slow walk. No, leave her alone. Don't overdo it. give you despair everyone's favorite oh fuck Aerith I'm so happy you can use healing win right now even if it kind of sucks help Aerith why aren't you using healing wind I pressed it honestly this is probably better how long does nullify damage last though the cloud didn't heal okay that much Thanks, Aerith. Thanks, Aerith. Thank, thank you. <laughs> Thanks. I know, it's like freaking... It's like you make these plans and then the game's just like, oh, you changed your mind? I'm like, no, I didn't. So why did you use the limit? Or whatever. You just healing with and you cast it? Yeah. I, I've noticed it does cancel it sometimes. Limit <laughs> breaks protects against all freaking that was just Aerith's plan. Whatever, freaking Mr. Fancy cutscene. Yeah, Aerith, I know you can be sassy and troll Cloud a lot, and while I appreciate it, now's not the time. This is pretty boss entrance though. I love it. 
This should be a super cut with how many times Cloud says Sephiroth, how many times Sephiroth says Cloud, and see Together. which one does it more. I'm gonna Sonic Boom your ass first, Sephiroth. I'm warning you now. I, I forgot to, to do that last time. Thank you. I saw what you did back there, Cloud. Thank you. Take me later. This ain't over. Right. <laughs> okay, let's finish this. Is that it, mother? One more shot! God, his slow walk is so cool. See, none of this matters to him. He doesn't give a shit. Oh god, it's the behind him. Oh my god, cloud. Don't even bother. That shit won't work on me. Whatever, I I need to. Oh, what is the wing even? I have to attack the wing. Loud. Really don't want to use items anymore. But... Okay, this is uh, it's weak to ice. Oh my god. Am I still getting hit here? I seem to do really good. And then Aerith. God damn it! <laughs> Get pressured, loser. Not gonna matter though. Cloud's dead. You'll feel better in a second. You'll feel better. You need to heal up. Shall I sever your fate? You will. Okay, please. He's running towards us. No! No! He's, oh, he's okay, he's okay. Here, Sephiroth, come here. Perfect. Oh, he disappeared. Oh, he teleported right in front of us! Him ragdolling. See, I really didn't think she'd be in a boss fight, so I would have given more materia. And now I'm suffering for it. Oh, I need to use magic real bad. Okay, I don't think I'm gonna have enough time. Did she do that then? Okay, planet protection or probably that one. Nothing personal. Nothing personal. It's absolutely personal. He's he's up. He's up. I kind of can't really do anything with her.
Odin's a two guy? Okay, Aerith, um... Can we wing attack his wing? I know it's like immune... Is it just magic? Oh, I don't know what that did. Shield. Cool. Okay, I, I really want to summon Odin, but I kind of need the wing. Keep it together. Wait, will that matter? Odin, help! This is the first time I've summoned him. He's... He's my favorite, and I haven't even summoned him. But this is the time. And then... Oh God, this music right now with Odin. And then, and then she... Her ATB grows real fast right now. Her ATB could be used for Odin. Ouchie. Hang back. Oh my god, I don't think I have the level 3 limit breaks. I don't know what else I can really do with Aerith. <laughs> oh, it's gone. Dude, Sephiroth getting on Tetsuke is so sick. I know it like didn't insta and all that, but still. I'm gonna do one of these. Yes! Sentient God, I wish I had level three. Oh, that was the thing anyway. The music was perfect for his limit, wasn't it? The end is nigh. Oh, well, that's not very good. No, his health bar. His health bar. Oh, he's pressured. Cloud. No. I need to get my ATB up. Almost. Woo! All right. Oh, he's so dramatic. Braver him! Lost to a basic attack! <laughs> and a again, but still. That was so freaking scary. I don't even know what he was doing. Shooting lasers out of his wings. He laughed. Why is he laughing? Thank you. Because he knows this isn't over. Brilliant. Seen part three, Sephiroth. He just flew to part three. He did all that just to lose, and he's all like, oh, it's not over. Whatever, Seth. I'm not buying it. We kicked your ass. He, he didn't know I had Odin. Can Zack be here too? Look, this is like a perfect third spot. Aww. Ready? Aww. Everybody's waiting. Thank you. 
damn, this is like a promo shot. You're telling me this is the, the very end of the game? That's so sad. Yeah, it's just like AC, yeah. That's so sweet. Not really. <laughs> I don't want it to end. Alright, well... I'm guessing Zach may have got him. exhausted his livingness. Oh, is his world's destined for Meteor? Is that what's happening? So this is it, huh? Oh! So all of them are fucked except for Prime? No, not for now! Aerith, bring him to Prime World. See ya. <laughs> Why are they so, like, happy about everything? It's like, I think he's in on it. Aerith, wake up. But that ain't our Aerith. I think he's just in tune with the multiverse or whatever because he was in it. I think he's... Because we saw him walk to the dead Aerith, and then it transitioned to whatever Aerith that was. Oh. Have them all being here? It could just be delusional too. Oh, Barrett! Me too. Can't stay here forever. We'd best get moving. Yep. Sounds good. That was weird. Did he... The guy's just gonna be seeing her everywhere now. I'll see you off. He's gonna be talking to Aerith, but people are just gonna assume he's talking to no one. Damn. <gasps> Winston. 
That's so cool. Aww. Aww. Daddy said. Tifa. Come on. He looked at where Aerith would be. Oh no! Cloud- It's like Cloud- he He's smiling because he's like delusional or something. I'm like, poor Tifa lost their friend. Rufus, this isn't about rich kids right now, okay? Shouldn't you be, go be making I friends? Have to admit, you were quite the man. When? Well, then don't ruin this. <laughs> I guess not. Anyway, you haven't seen Viceroy Saruf, have you? He He's failed to not show real. an important event. Made us look like fools. Maybe he wouldn't have if you'd spent some money on that set. <laughs> ah, you're probably right. Rich kids do like things just so. Still got results, though, even without him. Resistance elements are more fired up than ever. You know, Glenn, I'm on to you. This war is nothing but a ploy to distract me from Sephiroth. Hey, he's smart. <laughs> How very astute. Oh. Regardless, the plan oh. is already in motion. Wait, it was a Sephra? Damn it, Glenn! A father's dream accomplished by his son. I want the real thing, not some imitation. <laughs> but an imitation is all you deserve. Nice. Proud of you, Rufus. But, I mean, you got one HP. In the back. Just like old times. Oh. He just has zone demons. Yeah, that was a... I like seeing Rufus lose it. So Sephiroth was using Glenn to fool Rufus this whole time too. Nice. So Glenn's not real? Rufus did in fact kill Glenn. And now these baby weapons. Are they protecting Holy? Is that what I- They're glowing. Yo, okay, which sack is this? We're gonna get a new dog breed. Did I? Okay, is this- I couldn't have dreamt that. It's definitely not the one that got meteored. It all felt way too real. Just as worlds unite, so too do they part. <laughs> but who's to say they can't unite again? 
Have they? Let's see a dog. Show us one dog. Nibelheim the next day? Are they all seeing this, I guess? Yeah, Zach's alive somewhere. Maybe they left it ambiguous on purpose. Because if the worlds did merge, that's pretty cool. I mean, it only makes sense after all that multiverse and fighting bullshit. Like, it only makes sense for it to merge. Oh my god, they're humming the music. Oh. Vincent. Can you know what these are just a wee bit higher? Screw you, cat. Oh, he's just imagining Aerith now. Oh my god, it's gonna be so sad. Nice catch. So, what Aerith actually do anyway? He still has it. Cloud. What'd you do? The reunion. Cloud. Hey, oh my god. I mean, obviously. Yeah. One sec. Obviously, it wouldn't have been over, but damn. No! Cloud! What have you done? Oh my god. Angel's rolling his grave right now. Oh my god. You'll have to promise not to look up. Oh. Don't look up. Wait, is he imagining well, that? Now I gotta look. That's fine. <gasps> fine, but don't let it get to you. Oh my god, Cloud's crazy. What get to me? It's not real. Just an illusion. <laughs> He's so insane. Now let's go get Sephiroth. He's hiding up north. He, I don't think he's fit to be a leader anymore. Trust me, he is. Soldier's intuition. Oh, yeah? Better hope you're right. <laughs> All right, fine. We trust you. Keep up, please say something. <laughs> Just remember, we got everything riding on this. And that's a load you'd best be ready to carry. <sighs> and no heavy loads. We're close to capacity as it is. Nice. Cloud and that mental worry state. About me. I can handle it. Okay, getting back. And if I said I wasn't, <laughs> no, 
Don't worry. They're like, why is Cloud it's just like a second home. talking to Air? Oh, Paris, Air. But what if, what if something happens? <gasps> then I'll send up smoke. Thanks. I'll keep an eye out. Oh my god, this is like really heartbreaking and scary. <laughs> Cloud is not okay. I'll put everything I've got into oh, it's the hands. shot! Oh, it's so pretty. I'll stop the meteor. And I'll leave the rest to you. Good luck. Aerith. I will stop Sephiroth. Trust me. Well, she will. You promise? Promise. Oh, now we're gonna get the shot. Yo! He fixed it! There it is! Oh, where is... Oh, the theme is gonna kick in. Thank you, UV Cross. We did it. We have other things to worry about now. Guys, I'll be fine. It's a... But Cloud's not. He's freaking gone. That's... Oh my god. Thank you for watching me play this game. Uh, oh no, I'm thinking of tier one. I'm not expecting that ending. I'm glad that it's still somewhat the same. So we didn't get the Aerith funeral in the water scene, but I like how they set up Cloud being kind of crazy and like in denial that she died. That's like scary. I was thinking if 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 he didn't say goodbye to her, I was thinking about um. Wait, what about Gilgamesh Island? No, I didn't do it yet. I have a lot to do post-game. Um, anyway. No, because if you didn't say goodbye to her, I was thinking part three is gonna have, like, a lot of moments where Cloud's just talking to Aerith, but no one knows. It's the same size Zack stuff, but I don't know if Seth is OG FF7. I think he is. <laughs> rehab! <laughs> Final Fantasy VII Rehab! That should be it! Oh, no, that's perfect! Yeah, I was saying like Batman seeing Joker constantly. That was a- I really like that ending. I, I- I like that that seemed like they may have- oh my god, everyone did so good in this. Like, all the voice actors did incredible. Thank you voice actors. Y'all are beautiful. There's been two. Hey, thanks, Matthew Mercer. Thank you for voicing one of my favorite characters ever. Um, was I saying? No, I think, I think he, I think he doesn't know. Aerith is dead. I, he could be in like massive denial. But I, I, I definitely think he lost it a little bit, or a lot of it, because he he has the black materia. He's talking to Aerith, Aerith as if he's there. He he looked back to Aerith before him and Tifa left. JD, yes. Oh, thank you for the gift sub. A little... At, at minimum, he's crazy a little bit. Rekki will come in part three. We'll see actual death burial flashback. I can see that. 
I played the OG, so I already know, like, where part three could go. Like, with Medeal. Dude, the Medeal part is gonna be so freaking... Like, it, it's gonna make so much more sense now. Because, like, he he was, like, starting to lose it at the end of the... Like, halfway through this game. <gasps> There's Greg! That's our friend! Um, he was already losing it halfway through. And so... When, when the whole Medeal part happens, when he's, like, in the wheelchair and stuff, he's definitely... It's definitely gonna add more weight to, like, how he got there. And then since Tifa had her experience in the livestream, she's gonna be a, probably better at being able to help him. I think... God, there's so much to say. Did I get enough Vincent? I'm... There's never enough Vincent. But I do, do like what I saw. No, no, I'm I'm not obviously she's part of the live stream, so Nanaki was able to feel her and stuff. I'm not saying that wasn't actually her spirit there. I'm I'm saying Cloud doesn't understand she's dead or doesn't want to believe she's dead. Like he thinks she's physically there is how I'm reading it. Because he's he's kind of acting like nothing's wrong. And whether or not you think that could be a denial thing, like that could be a part of it. Like a part of grieving is denial. But I, I definitely believe he thinks that she's physically there. Because especially with, like, their goodbye. Like, if he didn't have that goodbye with her, he's like, are you sure you're gonna be okay? Send a so smoke signal if you're fine. Like, it could it could be hard, co hard coping, whatever, but he's not... He's still not all, all right. Just don't get why he'd leave her there. Because Aerith could have wanted to stay. There'll be smoke signal in part three. He's like, it's Aerith, we gotta go. Probably also I know his limit break love and else he wasn't fighting for the same reasons. Yeah, exactly, because he didn't want to believe she died. And everyone else is pissed because Sephiroth killed her and they saw her kill they saw him kill her. She was alive, she wanted to stay and pray and cast holy. She tried. I think, like I said, even in the original and in the remake, I feel like it's pretty clear that Aerith knew what had to happen. She knew that the only way to stop Sephiroth is to join the livestream and cast Holy when the time comes. I can't wait till Cloud is less, like, handles all that crazy stuff. Like, his, seriously, like, our, uh, FF7 part three like being a therapy sequel oh it's gonna it's gonna be it's gonna be great it's gonna feel so good when cloud is actually like all better again and i hope it's i hope it, they don't drag it a little bit too much because like he's he's pretty full-blown the rehab as the subtitle is the best part for sure yeah i don't know where zach ties in but i think the fact that they they didn't show any sort of stamp mascot is very deliberate because they they don't want us to know what Zach what timeline Zach's in or if because we we're led to believe that it did in fact merge like what Sephiroth did like they they fixed the merging problem but we won't know for sure and also Cloud when he looked up in the sky and he's like don't look up in the sky it's just an illusion and everyone's like what are you talking about like that's there's nothing denial or cope about that Cloud is he's a little cuckoo at minimum cuckoo. Barrett had to look, there was nothing there. Once we have Cloud, all better while we're full party minus Aerith. Dude, the, the part in FF7 when, like, you... everything's, like, shitty for, like, the longest time. Like, the whole Junon prison thing and then Cloud losing it. But then when, like, Cloud snaps back to it and, like, the you're on the high wind and, like, the high wind theme starts playing and everything's suddenly really happy, that part freaking hits me. It is so happy. It's like finally, like we get a break after so much crap happening. And then, I yeah, and I, I can't wait for that in part three. I hope they do it similarly. It's probably gonna be even more of a big deal because they'll actually, you know, be able to build it up more. Hallucinating Aerith is different than hallucinating Sephiroth. Halluc hallucinating Sephiroth is because Sephiroth's like manipulating Genova, uh, the Genova cells to see the Marcos, the robed men, as him. 
Because, like, Genova sees, like, your greatest fears and all that negativity, right? And him hallucinating Aerith is just coping. What'd you say? Wait, wait, what if the entire time Aerith has been seeing the crazy sky because she's been saying since Remake how she misses the steel, steel sky? Oh yeah, maybe, because she's like, this sky, I don't like it. Oh yeah, maybe, I never really thought of that. Yeah. She never really mentioned it before. And like, in all of the other, in like the Aerith dream scenarios, she always had like a, a ruptured sky. Yeah, that's why they changed the line. Yeah, that makes sense, because they changed the line. Hmm. That's cool. She probably did see it all. But she'd have to see it, like, near the end, though, because I don't think there was... I don't think there was a rift in the multiverse or whatever until they destroyed the, uh, the Arbiters of Fate or whatever. It's a red herring to throw us all off. I don't know, because changing the voice line seems pretty deliberate. Town Zach see the impending doom, but not everyone else. No, they they saw it, because I Amira mentioned this guy. Said that then a remake. Did they came out of singularity? Right, like after they changed fate. The cloud not realizing and save Aerith. That's pretty much what I'm guessing. The rest of them? Well, I guess they weren't really there, but yeah. Cloud. Dude, Rufus was cool in that last scene. Oh my god, freaking Glenn. I knew I was right to dislike Glenn the whole time. It wasn't even Glenn. It was just a freaking Sephiroth clone harassing Rufus. I fucking knew it. Because I, I like Glenn in Ever Crisis. He's pretty cool, but he's such a freaking waste, like, nonsense character in Rebirth. And it's straight up exactly what it he is. He's just he's just a character to throw off Rufus. That's pretty smart of him to figure it out at the end. I knew something was up. I feel like Glenn's constantly just wasting Rufus's time and, like, bothering him. Yeah, also no Genesis. We did have to see Nero for a bit, but thank goodness no Genesis. Oh, thank goodness. I, yes, we completed disc one. Congrats on the disc one, everyone. Oh my god. If he didn't say it, there's no way to explain the Seth fight he has. If he didn't save her, he didn't save her. He just wanted to... He just wanted to get Sephiroth off his back at this point. But like it is it is weird how like I don't know it's just like everything about Cloud's behavior at the end there is just so telling cuz he's relatively like all things considered he's pretty calm about what's happening like everything like after Aerith dies like he sees her in her, his arms and she's like say like her eyes open like she's okay and I think that's like Aerith you know, willingly do that because she knew that he wouldn't be okay because he's already been uh, pretty fragile mentally fragile for a while so she knew that break him, she, she knew she had to do that and it worked because yeah, like I said, like he's way too calm for somebody who's like somebody really important to him just died I think he's pretty delusional. Main thing that answers these questions is if they're doubling down the multiverse in part three, because then that's it's all speculation. Yeah, that stuff's pretty all speculation. It just depends, like what, what, like what the aftermath of this is. Because like when when you destroy the arbiters of fate, it's just like all hell broke loose, like multiverse wise. But but now that everyone defeated Sephiroth in their multiverse, it's like has it reunited or ha has the world united again? Like, that's basically the speculation. Like, did we just undo all that? Because, and like I said, I think that's why they're not showing you anything from Zack. Because they're they're being very deliberate to make us wonder. Maybe they don't even know. Maybe they didn't even write that part yet. Because you can't ignore when Aerith pushed cow cowed, <laughs> Cloud. The extreme multiverse thing with stuff. The massive part of the end sequence. Yeah.
God, sorry. The this is it's hard to do post story chat with stuff like this because everyone we're all talking about different things. Yeah, it's a lot to take in. Like that's the thing. There's there's so many little things. And like I just beat the game. I'm sure people who beat the game like a couple days like days or weeks ago. Well, last week maybe. <laughs> Um, you know, have had time to think about it, but I just beat it, so I haven't had really- I haven't really had time to let things settle, and, you know, so I could be wrong and misguided about a lot of things, but I'm- I'm fairly confident about some things as well. You've certainly left us ton more questions. Yeah, it's- it, but it's just like how a Remake did, like, what- What does the Arbiter of Fate mean, like, now that it's gone? I just seen two days in game, I still don't know what happened. <laughs> well, I, I think what happened was clear. I think it's just the aftermath that, like, we don't know. Like, it can go anywhere. That's how I view it, personally. Yeah, even Tifa was like, what the fuck, dude? And when he's like, sounds good. I mean, that's the thing, like, he's so ready to just, like, stand up and, like, freaking go. Like, all right, guys, let's get on the plane. We gotta go stop Sephiroth. And they're like, are you crazy? And he's not even... He's not even questioning, like, if something's wrong with Tifa, because, like, why else should she be crying? Yeah, I I like that. I saw a theory where after Aerith got stabbed and Cloud is speaking with no sound, it's him in the original timeline. I was thinking that when he was moving his mouth. Because, like, I was waiting for him to say that. I was I was waiting for him to, to say the stuff where he's like, Aerith will no longer talk, cry, get angry, yada yada. I was waiting for that, because I wanted it to be similar to the OG. But we never got to hear it, but we saw his mouth move silently, so I was thinking that's that. Like, most sad for Tifa. My god, like, I, 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 feel, I feel so bad for Tifa at the end there, too, because it seems like she has to go through it alone. Because obviously, like, Aerith meant a lot to Cloud, but he's not mourning her because he doesn't think anything's wrong. And Tifa feels like she has to do this herself. Okay, Red's with her. The next game, Sephiroth's fight is gonna be insane. I'm just gonna do like all the phases. Hi, Reno. It's gonna be all the phases, but like, like from the past games. <laughs> so, like, he's gonna have like 12 phases. It being a sequel to 7 OG. Maybe. Maybe like the middle part is like the super diverging part. But that's gonna make things messy. If like let's say the world's you like united again. Like what does that mean for the people in those universes? Like are like are individual people gonna have random flashes of their multiverse counterparts? Yo, Junon. Right, like if they all they all merge, but does that mean their memories merge with them? I don't think he no, he only merged two universes. I don't think so. I think a lot of them died. I think it, he killed a lot of the mer the universes, but then the because because Sephiroth said like a lot of them are destined to expire or whatever because like the sky was tearing and I think anytime you saw the sky tear it's like that universe is just fucked from the beginning but then like obviously whatever world Zack's in is fine so that world could have like merged with prime world I don't think it's a secret se secret sequel at all I think it's been very upfront a sequel Like, like, playing Remake assumes you've played the OG. That would make it a pseudo-sequel. Includes the fact that he visits every universe to make sure he's going his plan. But I- Sephiroth very clearly has that power when- when he was, like, in the multiverse window with Cloud showing him everything. It seemed like Sephiroth very much has the power to just travel between everything and, like, he knows everything. At least six different stamps, three Sephiroth's lost, maybe some worlds did die. 
I think the world Zack was in that saw the meteor did die, but he got teleported somewhere else. That's the only explanation I have for it. Unless it's a different Zack, but he's... No, wait, no, because it. I think it is a, it, it is a different Zack, and he's just like, oh, that was weird. Did I dream that? It's so vivid. I think it's because the whole, like, the be there's all the Zacks merged type of deal. So... It did happen to him, it was just technically another universe. Like, like that Zack did die in that universe, but then the Zack that's still alive was technically in another universe, that's fine. So he could be in Prime, like, they could be merging the two that we saw. And then the ones that kept branching off that we saw for like five seconds of, probably, uh, died out. Would the sky tear even symbolize, though? I think it symbolized that that world was destined to die. Because that's what Sephiroth alluded to. Remake where Sephiroth tells Cloudy seven seconds. I think it's like the in-between. That's actually... That's... A lot of people theorized... And it makes sense. The seven seconds till the end line is the moment Sephiroth drops down to stab Aerith. Because if you watch the original cutscene, the moment he's at the top and the moment his blade pierces through Aerith, it's literally seven seconds. And he's all and Sephiroth's always taunting Cloud with that in the first game, right? And then in Rebirth, he actually did swing his sword to interrupt it. So it's like time enough for you perhaps right so he like tried to stop it but in the end it didn't matter anyway that's what the seven seconds is, could be again assuming the pseudo sequel because Sephiroth knows everything be oh my god what so annoyed when I let you do the boss of Zack just spams and attacks you <laughs> I know! Because I'm like, I have to get used to just wanting to get to level 3 and use his attacks. I know, that's why I didn't even bother. I'm like, look, I, I'm i in the middle of a boss fight by myself. I don't think I have the mental fortitude to learn how to work with Zack right now, so I'm just going to use level 1. It was fine. What was the whole point of Zack? Just like, uh, he, he's, he's like a, the pro tag of just other universes. This game's very much a multiverse type of thing, and Zack's just like a really easy way to do that. I love Zack, so I'm never opposed to seeing more of him. That fight with when it was him and Cloud, I was so hyped, but I feel like I feel like I was more hyped. It was like I was the most hyped, and then Zack was hyped to see his friend Cloud okay. And Zack and Cloud was just like, what the fuck? Like Cloud was the least hype. Oh, Aerith again. Zack's tutorial is the final boss. Zack made it to Prime Timeline. I hope he made it to Prime Timeline. Like, you can see he's at the church. The church is empty. The flowers were healthy. There was no one there. It wasn't, like, completely torn the fuck up. I think he may maybe made it to Prime World. And that could be why we didn't see a stamp dog. Because if we saw a stamp dog, we would know right away what you if he's in Prime Universe or not, you know? Like, what timeline he's in. But we don't know, so he could be anywhere. <sighs> Imagine Zack is a Laguna. Falls to the same place there as used to transport Cloud back to the remake world. That's just like her hub now. I can't wait. I really want to rewatch the ending and like other cutscenes again just to help set things in stone a bit more. There's just so much to talk about. I know that dog legit looks like one of the Billy Arts of Oliver. Oliver? Or Billy should sue. <laughs> Look, here he is! Oliver! Oliver! <laughs> You're falling! Oh, you made me pull a muscle in my arm. Look! It's my- It's my Aerith Dream stamp. My little Pomeranian. Oh, I pulled a muscle in my arm as I tried to pick him up. Oh. I bit your ear. Mwah. Oliver, are you Sephiroth? Do you know the endgame? What happened to the, your, your universe? Mwah. Oh, man.
Hey, look, it's Cloud. Are you feeling a lot better now, Cloud? Are you lunatic? <laughs> Chapter selection, hard difficulty. Well, I'm definitely gonna be doing that. I'm gonna. I, I still have a lot of post game stuff to do, like the Gilgamesh stuff, and I still have to beat the final Queen's Blood champion and stuff like that. And I'm definitely replaying through the game on hard mode. Um. There's still so much. I love this game so much. Like, I am sad the story is over. But I'm really glad that I also kind of know what's going on now. Well, know what's going on. Vaguely. There's just so much to talk about. I really want to have... I uh, I really just want to rewatch a whole bunch of stuff. Dude, how cool is Vincent, though? <laughs> I love how, like, like, clutch he came in half the time. Like, oh, there's a problem. Don't worry. Vincent's here to fix it. I loved- I loved it! Okay, ending aside though, I loved all the characters in it. They were all really fun to use. I love Sid. I love Vincent. They are perfect. I cannot wait to play as them. Uh... Let's see, but how cool is Vincent? <laughs> I just- I don't know, I feel like when it comes to the ending, like, there's- Like I said, I just beat it, so my- Feelings on it are fresh, and I haven't had as many t much time as other people with like theorizing stuff. But I I feel I feel like I have a decent like grasp of my interpretation of the ending. But um, where the story could go is very interesting and open. Also, saying thank you for the sub three minutes ago. I missed it. Yeah, the soundtrack was amazing. The gameplay is great. I really didn't use utilize synergy stuff all that much like in the beginning. But now I'm excited to uh, use, like, probably utilize it more on hard mode, where I'll really need to. There's like 400 songs of this. I know, I feel like we didn't even hear all of them. Favorite boss fight? Vincent? <laughs> it is Miles had a remake with a lot of stuff. I'm really glad they, they said that they have a lot of stuff ready for part three. It's, it's really just like, I'm sure a lot of the sequence stuff is the hard part, like, you know, the characters and the cutscenes and directing and all that. Matt Mercer go. Yeah, he's incredible. Demon Wall was so good. Thank you, Duo Death. Quickly offer spoilers. So much of part three has to be an F S a flip. Yeah, but there's also things like Medeal and Wu Tai. Um Rocket Town. Fort Condor, like there's still new places. And you don't really go back to the old places as much. Like you do go to Midgar. They're gonna go in on Wutai. Wutai is gonna probably feel like Midgar scale. They're making that massive part of the game, no doubt. Definitely, especially with like as much as they're hyping up the Wutai War. Oh yeah, and all the underwater segments. Oh my god, like one of the side quests actually having having you go to like a submarine dock or whatever. I I was just like sub dock? Like it's already setting up. So what or order do we go next in terms of areas? Um well like the icicle in I don't even I can't even think right now. Well we'd have to go to Rocket Town because we didn't hear. We'd have to go to Fort Condor, we didn't hear. I know Icicle Inn's like technically next. But it doesn't seem like they'd be going the way in this game. I know, I really hope Deep Ground's not as much of a thing. Well, see... Wait, if Cloud's just crazy and Aerith is just death and loses all purpose or dead, she have to join the streamline. Spirit to stop Meteor. Purpose thinks she's gone. No, but but that's that's part of the development for part three is Cloud coming to terms with that. Because Cloud Cloud already is like go, like losing it in uh like when I well, okay I'm gonna say part three when I'm in terms of the OG because obviously OG is just one game but Cloud's already losing it at that point in the game. Um, it's just you know now we're gonna ha we have like more of a build up. Yeah, like. The Aerith death breaks him, but he's broken for other reasons in this, in this trilogy. Yeah, and now Cloud has the Black Materia, too. Part 3 should be called. Apparently we're voting on Rehab. 
Why does Red feel Aerith's presence if he's hallucinating? He's he's not hallucinating. Aerith is there. He just doesn't believe she's dead. She believe he believes she's physically there. But she's part of the life stream. They already used reunion for Crisis Core. I can't really see that. Using it again. We just saw the black material. It just absorbed into it, right? Oh my god. Lace I say I know this is the last I straight stay for a while. It's freaking 3 a.m. Thank you for joining me. Maybe Cloud just saw Eris going back to Midgar or something? Maybe. That could have been a good lie. She's just like, yeah, I gotta go back home to my mom. And he's like, okay. Is that how softening materia works? Maybe with the black materia it does. That was your watch. I know, Sam. I can't believe we went through this journey together. I streamed this game for nine days in a row, all like 12 plus hours each. And <laughs> I've been grinding the hell out of this. I spent like a hundred, I have 111 hours in. A lot of that's not like pure gameplay. Sometimes I'm just like wandering around looking at stuff because I love it. It's over. I'm finally free. I can't wait to play the game again on hard mode. Um, for a real challenge. I don't know. Some of this shit on normal is a challenge. Some of that Sephiroth stuff. But see, like, on next playthrough, I'll actually be able to have the proper materia that I need. Like, damn, put... If I have a second element, elemental materia, I could put that on, like, Barrett so you can actually clip those wings. Yeah, all the dates. Probably not next stream. Maybe. I don't know. If I can easily do it on next stream, yeah. Anyway, I'm going to do everything. I don't want to take any days off. I don't want to stop playing. I want to keep playing tomorrow as well. And the day after. I'm not going to take a day off until I I crash and burn. Otherwise, I just want to keep playing FF7. Dude, Oliver is pissed. What's the next one? Play log! Yeah, I, I saw the choosing chapter 8 or 12. I definitely want to do watch the other dates. We can do that tomorrow. We can watch the dates tomorrow, and I'll just do all the post-game stuff, and then I'm not going to start hard mode tomorrow. I'm doing post-game stuff, and then once I catch up with, like, what I want to do, then I'll be ready for hard mode. Sparky and Anger. It seems to start from the dates, pick whoever. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I got that. <laughs> now the story is ever can actually play a game while watching too gross in it. That's that, that's how I feel. I can beat the game. I can start my life now. God, it's so good, though. I loved it so much. I can't believe 111 hours in of just, like, a lot of, like, mostly nonstop gameplay has, hasn't gotten bored. Like, even getting all, like, 100% of intel in regions is fun. The proto relics were good. I loved most of the side quests. Like, they they improved on that, too. Because the side quests and regular remake were mostly bland. There was a couple cool ones, like the Behemoth one. Uh, 16 is cool. Dragon's Dogma eventually. I don't want to talk about... I don't care about... Let me get... Here, guys. Let me say something. I don't give a shit about any other game right now, okay? If you ask me about playing a game, I'll be like, sure. But I don't care. <laughs> I only care about Rebirth. Once I beat the game on hard mode, I'll probably care about other games. But until then, Rebirth. Mostly kidding, but also partially serious. Head empty, only FF7. Vincent's in it. What more could I ask for? <laughs> it's the best! Care about either game. How's that Sephiroth fight supposed to be possible with no item usage? Just like if you can DPS in chakra and pray help a lot. Normally hate open worlds and never got tired of this. Yeah, the open world in this game did really well. Because nothing really feels empty. Like all the locations are pretty varied. They all have their own. Like I they have environmental storytelling to it. Like if some place is a shithole, like there's a reason for it. And some some places just like the field itself is different. Like Gongaga's being a jungle, you know. It's it's really they nailed it with the open world, and it doesn't clutter you with a bunch of bullshit to do like task wise. 
Forgotten Capital, whatever. Yeah, I was go okay. Yeah, the the main thing I am disappointed about too, like ending wise, is like the Forgotten Capital was pretty forgotten. I I was I was so hyping up that moment in my head, like that part where you just like walk down the the Capitol and then you go to the altar at the end, right? And it's like this big fucking deal. And it's so cool and like the music's playing. They just went right into just action. It did bum me out. Like I said it when it happened. I'm like, oh man. Especially since they tease it, they, they it just it's it just becomes a cutscene and then a boss fight. I know that it's that's that was that was a huge bummer. I've been hyping that moment up since like before remake got announced. You know, I'm sure like a lot of people did, or like not before, but like when it got announced, they're like, "Holy shit, remake! I can't wait to see the Forgotten Capital." You know, like that is a huge moment. No bone village. I even predicted that the chocobos would help you find the lunar harp. Because that's similar, like their mechanics are similar to how you get it in the original. I was wrong about that. There was no lunar harp. Er one of Aerith's multiverse selves guided you instead. It almost seems like they ran out of time. They're like, fuck it, just put the fight at the front of the Forgotten cap Capital instead of in the back. Like they could have, like that's the thing, they could have done the exact same thing that they did. Just make the entrance of the boss fights like in the back. They didn't have to put it right in the front door. Like to me, it just kind of seemed like they maybe like, ran out of time. Like they rushed it to fit in or something, maybe. Yeah, maybe Bone Village will have a repurpose or a, will be repurposed for something else. Um. Probably their scapegoat. Blew their budget on the 40 hour Sephiroth final fight and the heart and the ass had a nerve to float away like nothing happened. He seriously just like, like, oh, I'll see you later. I'll see you in part three. Flying away with his shitty little wing. Nah, it's a cool wing, whatever. Sephiroth, good, good fight, I guess, you little cheater. Fight was so exhausting. Takes like an hour and a half. It, what, it definitely, yeah, it was freaking long. I don't mind. I, I think I definitely prefer stuff like that over Arbiters of Fate in Remake. But I still like I like the fight with with Cloud and Aerith versus Sephiroth the most. Because it's just like the big open backdrop was awesome. And I really like fighting fights like that where you actually like are on a field instead of just big walls. I know like big wall bosses, like all the, Sep the Sephiroth Reborn phases. I know that's like really common in a lot of RPGs and even just action games. So it's like, I get it, but it doesn't always have to be a wall. Like Demon Wall was sick. That was a great fight. I like the uh, surprise that there was a second one. I'm like, <laughs> what now? That was really cool. But I hate fighting Sephiroth Reborn. It's just a wall boss. Oh, gotta clip its wings. Oliver. Fighting with Zack was really cool. It is interesting that they're going to do the same thing. Like, th like when you fight Sephiroth in the OG, and it does the picture flashback between the two. And that happens at the end of Remake. It happened at the end of this with Zack. Like, they're just going to do it again in part three, and it's going to be like, oh, this again. The only difference is they're going to be shirtless, maybe. <laughs> what if Cloud's shirtless, too? Just make it a Yakuza fight. The Zack tag team was great. <laughs> Sh shirtless one-on-one -on -one fight. Shirtless, you say? In the rain, perhaps? Oh, bring in the rain in this. Cruel for make you think Aerith survived for a second. That was really cruel. I was like, I, I, I kind of had a feeling it wouldn't be so happy. Like, nah, that was too easy. But then they did it anyway. It was very cruel. <laughs> with a bunch of oil. <laughs> they just grease each other up in Mako or something. Oh my god. I'm waiting, Cloud. Oh, this is so good. Yeah, that, that end was a bit... I don't know. I Multiverse stuff in general always gets so weird. I can't say I like that they did multiverse stuff in FF7, but I'm 
I'm interested in like the topic of it. I like talking about it. I like trying to figure out what's up because I like the characters so much. So I can like deal with the fact that it's multiverse. Good. I'm glad Genesis gets ignored. He doesn't need to be in this. Your own interview with Faint brought you there, etc. or something. I think I think her's the one the part of her surviving. I think maybe it could have been another timeline, because like even Cloud was tripping during that time. Or it could have just been his delusions. Sephiroth's pretty We've seen Sephiroth's pretty good at fooling Cloud. Nero's coming back, wherever that showed is. He has to. Like, they teased him with Sonon. The interview with Faye creates a new world. Yeah, and at the end, when you destroyed all the Sephiroth Reborns, uh, seemed like it merged, so who knows? Who knows? We'll see. We'll see in part three. Whenever that is a thing. I like theorizing, but I also... I also don't like it, the thought of just, like, moving on already. I like discussing just, like, rebirth. A lot of people are like, okay, what's next? What's next? What's this? And I'm like, I don't know. I got a hundred hours in this game, and I love it so much, and I'm still willing to keep talking about what we have now, you know? They're an underwater base, no doubt. What, Nero? <laughs> well, deep ground. If they're in deep ground, then they're they're under freaking Midgar. Oh, Bok, that's, that's the whole lore of Deep Ground, that Shinra built secret bullshit called Deep Ground under Midgar. It was so secret, most of Shinra didn't even know about it. But it's just under Midgar. Like. <laughs> Keep it a secret. How it is convoluted. Yeah, well, it just depends. I th it makes for interesting conversation, but it doesn't even fit in the established setting. It sucks. Yeah, it really doesn't. Like, everything about Dirge's story sounds like they wanted to do something else and just later turned it into a Final Fantasy game. Yeah, seeing Cisne was cool. Any timeline where Cisne is a good person is pretty neat. Hojo bullshit the place. Hey, Cloud. <gasps> Whoa! Red and Ketchy's loveless outfits. You cannot leave the main menu at this time. <laughs> you cannot replay any chapter from the beginning. You return to the title screen without first saving. You'll be unable to use this data in subsequent playthroughs. Cloud's staring at me like a psycho. I need to save before he ruins my life. Here, let me save at the front again. Where's my new game plus file? There it is. There's that chapter selection on the top of it. Well, we'll definitely continue from there. Because I have a lot of side stuff to do. And I have a lot of hard mode to suffer through. It's gonna be great. The theory that Sephiroth's spitting the timeline spread the live stream. Since Earth can't save it from Meteor. Well, I don't know. Is that a theory? Because I thought that was pretty much what he was doing because he kept like he he was allowing these timelines so that he could so so that he could kill the timelines and create more live stream for himself because it's like he wants to take over like like it's not enough to just summon meteor on one planet he wants to summon meteor on all the universes so it's more live stream for him i kind of figured that was his plan he's being extra yeah not 100% confirmed, it's heavily implied. Right, that's why I mean, like, I don't know if that's like a, like an out of bounds theory. I thought it was kind of pretty forefront with that. Like, yeah, he, like, he, he, he definitely, he's definitely afraid of Holy. Like, he knows what's gonna happen if anyone has their hands on Holy. Well, Sephiroth, someone's got Holy. So the part at the temple, he's trying to reveal something. I don't want to see what he's revealing. The original timeline. Never just wants his VF to finally accept him. No, ain't gonna happen. The only part that sort of confuses me. 
Yeah, no Aerith in the next game, but party member's gonna feel weird. But that's okay. We got her in this game still for a bit. We have Aerith playable for three years until she's not. That's empty materia that non-prime Aerith gives clouds exactly what turns into meteor. Yeah, I think... I don't know what her plan was to give it to Cloud, but I believe Sephiroth probably knew about it and corrupted it in some way. Vincent Healer. <laughs> I mean, anyone can be a healer. Always replace Aerith with... Sh Dude, Shinra middle manager. Oh my god, I have to beat him in all the games. Oliver... He's barking. I gotta let him go. Um, I'm gonna end the YouTube stream. Thank you for watching, YouTube. And I'm here now. <laughs> triple streaming on kick. I it's too much for my my pea brain. Oh man, I don't want to. I feel like if I if I close the game out, I feel like that's it. I don't know. I, I'm i in this weird place where, like, I know normally when you beat a game, you feel empty because, like, the story is done. Like, I don't know. I don't really feel empty because I feel like a lot of stuff did get resolved in a weird way. But, and I also, and I also know that I still have so much to do. So I don't really feel like I have, like, massive post-game depression. Well, no, I know the story isn't over, but like that, but that's not what I'm saying. I'm saying, like, I don't feel sad that I beat the game. Look at the stat screen for the real hundred percent. Where do I do that? Like when I beat remake, I was pretty sad that it was over just like that because there's less to do. But this game, I still have more to do. Extra settings? Yo, chapter 8 companion. Yes, I can't wait to set these so that... Intimate. Can I share an intimate scene with Vincent? Skips Zach's story? Not sure where it is. Get a chapter select. Select a chapter, certain manuscripts can only be obtained on hard difficulty. Manuscripts? Give me Zaxter also skips the dream date with Aerith. Oh, that's weird. Is it play log? Oh, that's cool. I like this. Hold on. Combat. Is there an actual percentage? Or do you mean like you just have to count all of these? World Intel progress. I'm missing four. What am I missing four on? Perfectly executed odd jobs. Oh my god. There's six date six date companions and five in intimate dates. There's like one thing I have a hundred percent of. The f oh 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 the the Gilgamesh proto relics. <laughs> no, I missed one conversation with her. I was gonna say, like, of course Tifa's the one that's like all check mark. What did I miss with her? I mean, we'll find it. Ninety nine percent. 82, 86, 74. Catchy doesn't have one. <laughs> Literally one. <laughs> one convo. What food did I choose? I don't remember. S stew. Stew. That was the correct one. No Vinny stat. Yeah, the pot roast, that one. Oh, that's what that means? I thought it meant that... Oh my god, so I got almost every conversation perfect with her? Do I know my Tifa or what? 
I think I know which one it is. I think it's it's probably the one in uh, Lower Junon. Because I didn't pass her test. In that conversation in the inn. Damn, so close. I cannot believe. I cannot believe I was 90. Oh my God, I'm impressed. That's my girl. That's that's my Tifa.